literally after joining me as i finish my day well i say finish i'm going to do something else before i go home but i'm waiting for a big shane to give me a lift because today on the Yablu calendar actually yeah i should have said that at start welcome back to the Yablu calendar blah 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 i have no idea what day this is whatever year it is anyway <laughs> i'm waiting for a big shane um you know the guy that has the blue mondeo yeah he's giving me a lift over to get something and I'm gonna bring you with me. And it's not far away from where I am, so let's go. Woo! That was impeccable timing. When he's in a hurry, he's some man to go, but Jesus, when I'm in a hurry, he barely gets caught. Look at the dirt. Look at the dirt. The state of this and the state of that. Still have this as well. This is meant to go back, but I don't think I'll even make it back to far tonight. It's a lot dirtier than the last time we've seen it anyway, that's for sure. Ugh. Look at the amount of lights in the back of it. Right. Move this out his way, he'll put this in. We'll get on the road. It's too good in here, but as you can tell, I got uh, an FH5 for a couple of days. So uh, I'm testing this one out. This is only, it's a Globetrotter 500. And I literally just picked it up this evening and I'm gonna feck off home in it and then start again in the morning. And then we'll go from there. So this will be a, a couple of videos this this series. I'm just having a nosy around it. I'm just getting familiar with my surroundings. Uh, Irish commercials on this particular one. And uh, Basically, I'm waiting for my new one to come in January, so I'm waiting to see. Uh, basically, I'm testing out to see what they're like. To be honest with you, I haven't had a version five out on test. I haven't. This is like actually the first time I've driven a version five, and um, I'm just going to give you my thoughts on it. I thought that was something else. I'm just going to give you my thoughts on it um, over the week and see how it progresses and see if I'm happy with it. I'm happy with my choice because. I picked one of these because, as you would have seen last year, I fell in love with the turbo compound I had and ever since then i've been longing for a volvo so i have this now i have it for a couple of days gonna test it hard gonna be doing the steel on it and uh, i'm just having a nosy around you always can have a nosy around here hang on have a look at this so finally get to look at all these screens and stuff that's oh i better get that phone number over there it's not important believe me um yeah so i'm just i'm literally just getting familiar here with you guys uh, I think she's just a standard enough spec. It's got the leather seats. Uh, it's got the under storage compartment. Um, this is where the coffee maker would go. Hint, hint. Uh, this is just, that's just there. That's your fridge. Um, that's your passenger's seat. I'm surprised there isn't an armrest on the outside of that. Now that's my first query of why, that, why there isn't one there. I've got an armrest though, so. Anyway. <laughs> Um, and the turbo compound compared to this one last year I know that there's a mode button here and it actually changes my modes here look so I can put it in eco normal or hill mode that'll be interesting now I'm looking forward to trying that out and yeah just in, I'm just looking forward to messing with it to be honest with you and enjoying having a walk around it and a walking tour um, and the outside of it it's very similarly spec to the one I have coming it wouldn't be miles away from it so I'm not going to give you too many details about my one because my one's pretty special but uh this one is a 500 it's got what does it have six by two super singles all around on air at the back no air suspension on the front of the cab all the volvo um work lamps from factory on this one 
and this one's got a bit of extra paint on it because Irish commercials took it in and made it their own, put a bit of paint on it here and there. So yeah, it's not it's not a lot different now compared to the version four that I had last year. But uh, there's a few nice subtle changes that they did definitely need to change. But tell you one thing, right, that they won't tell you about Volvos, right? Is if you're not gonna be tramping with two lads, get rid of the top bunk, get a single occupancy. It doesn't matter what size cab it is, if it's just a globe charter cab like this or an XL, get rid of that. Because it's listen listen to this, right? Just just listen to this. Hear that? It's like that all the way down the road. So believe me, you want rid of that. Um what else have we got? Just just it's just a nice yoke. It's just it's got the foam topper on it. Uh, I'm trying to figure out whether I can get a night out this week and I probably will be able to get one I might do one tomorrow's Wednesday so I'll do an overnight Thursday into Friday yeah that'll be nice yeah that'll be definitely nice to get paid on Thursday have an old scoop while I'm, while I'm parked up so this wants to turn off on me now I'm literally just waiting for my brother so I can get a few bits of him and show him it and see what he thinks of it so yeah this is the FH version 5 we'll take a quick look around the outside of it so sorry about how dark it is and I'm robbing buying values warehouse but I just wanted to give you a quick walk around it 500 just got all the war clamps hello friend yeah so it's pretty nice do you want know the fun thing about these the side lamps indicate now as well because you've got your indicator now on the door when you turn your indicators on these flash now as well I don't know if that's a thing Irish commercials did themselves are it's a thing that all the new Volvos have but I'll find out over the week here's the front of it so it's got the new shape headlights. Now I haven't taken it on a really dark road yet, so I can't tell you what they're like, but it's got six barmans up on top. So that's our home for the evening. Just the most to click the wing kit in properly. What's going on here? Here we go, that's better. Yeah, so that's our home for the evening. I can't wait to start using it now tomorrow. It's getting a full load of steel on it. And we're going to, where are we going to? Kilkenny, uh, Cashel, Limerick, and Nina on the way back. So, busy enough all day for it tomorrow. Test out, see what it's like. You can see yourself here. She's got super singles all around. Painted black donut rings. They actually painted these badges black here as well. I know you can't really see them. You'll see them better tomorrow morning. These are all painted black as well. Shut up, dog. God, she'd bark at the wind blowing past her. I swear to God. Yeah, so that's our home now for the evening. So, we have a parked out here and she will look to business now in the morning. I can't wait to see it hooked up to a flat, chain down a load and see how we get on with it. I said I'll use the truck for lighting. So guys, uh, this one was a very, very short video, but uh, there are more videos to come with this, more full in-depth videos about what we're gonna do with it and stuff like that. And, uh, God, this is a blue camera, killing me. But I can't wait to test out I am going to knock you out, bleeding dog. Um, so yeah, I can't wait to test it out properly. What is your problem? It's me. It's me. Yeah, yeah, me. Um, so yeah, I can't wait to test it out now tomorrow. See what she's like, and uh, we'll see what she's doing. See what she's doing fuel wise, miles to the gallon, stuff like that. Right, I'm going in to make me... Well, actually, I'm not going in, because I'll tell you why, right? I swapped this, or I didn't even swap this. I left my truck in the yard, got a lift over to collect this, and then I, I was there thinking that, oh, my missus is going to be home, so I won't even need the keys or anything like that. I didn't, all I brought was my wallet, the keys for that, and my phone. That was literally it. No charges, nothing. Everything else is still in my other truck. And got home. Nobody here. Typical. Bleeding typical. So, that's my crack. Yeah, so I'm going to sit here and think about my dinner that's on the other side of that door that I can't get into. Hmm. And I don't leave a spare key out here because... Booglets. Because of booglets. That's why. I don't want anyone breaking into my house. So, look at that. Look at that. This, is, this lighting makes me look pretty young. Doesn't it? I wouldn't, you wouldn't be able to tell that I'm absolutely wrecked on the other side of the light. Anyway. I'll talk to you tomorrow, lads. Short and sweet this episode, but that's why we're going to keep it with this one. Uh, more in-depth videos of this to come. We're going to do an overnight in it. And should be a bit of crack. So stay tuned for that. Thanks very much for watching. Again, see you tomorrow. Blah, blah, blah. <laughs>
Oh.